Good morning. Happy Saturday. We rode all the way down to Bangor so that my husband can get his truck worked on again. We're gonna go shopping and eat some good food. Let's go together. Let's go shopping at my favorite place, TJ Maxx. I apologize, this is a horrible angle, but we're gonna do a little haul of the stuff that I got at TJ Maxx. Okay, we're gonna save the best for last. Okay, I got this really cute um, leopard or cheetah, whatever you want to call it, sweater, so cute. It's so soft too, feel how soft that is. So nice. <laughs> it's lovely, can't wait to wear this to work and stuff for the fall and winter months. <clears throat> um, I got um, TJ Maxx is the best place for me to buy some multi-surface cleaner so this is my favorite one it's lemon verbena it's literally only $3.99 and it smells so freaking good so we got another one of those we needed a restock I went through the jewelry aisle and I didn't find a whole lot that I liked but I did find these really cute earrings and they were on sale for $8. Look how cute. Can you see them? Obsessed with bows, obviously. So cute. Can't wait to wear these. Nothing special, but TJ Maxx is also the best place for doggy poop bags. <laughs> and saving the best for last. You guys, look how freaking cute this is. For Halloween, the little boo ghosties. I am literally obsessed. Hopefully they have one for Christmas time too. <laughs> okay, let's go to Sam's Club. I kind of suck at vlogging today. I didn't get any footage of the Sam's Club shopping. So I will do a little haul of what we got when we get home. We are starving. So we're going to go get five guys, some burgers, some fries. And then we have to go to Walmart. We're not getting those hot fries. I want the hot fries. I like the hot fries. The spicy ones, I know. Anyways, we're going to get the spicy fries. <laughs> uh, I forgot what I was talking about. Oh, and there is a new Mexican... Um, Ooh, my hair is nasty. Uh, there is a new Mexican ice cream place in the Bangor area. So we're going to go try that out today, too. Hopefully we have enough room for it. <laughs> Hopefully we have enough room for it later. I'm excited. So let's go to Five Guys. Five Guys. Five Guys. Not everyone's a smart student. 
two hours later. Okay, here's a little haul of the stuff that we got from Sam's Club. So we got some dishwasher pods. These are the best chicken wings. If you have a Sam's Club membership, you should try those. They're so freaking good. We got these. These are new to me. Some chicken bites for like lunches and things to put with some salads and rice and things like that. My husband's favorite um, creamer caramel macchiato. How fancy. We get this three pack of bacon. It just lasts forever and it's good. And we got pierogies. This is Mrs. T's. We love pierogies too. I'm so glad that we started eating those like what last year maybe. I got some granola bars. This is a three, well, 36 bars, but it's a three type strawberry, blueberry, cinnamon, apple. These are also for like snacks and things for work. These grapes are so good. They taste kind of like cotton candy. They're so good and it's a good way for us to get our fruit in. Some spicy nacho Doritos, of course. And we're going to try this Members Mark pizza. We've never had it before, but it looks good. And it's self-rising crust, so, yep. Okay, that's our Sam's Club haul. Sorry, I had to do that Sam's Club haul really fast because the stuff has been in the car for way too long. And we needed to get it in the fridge. But I wanted to show you the outfit that I got from Walmart. And hopefully it fits, so we'll find out. It's this, um... It's like a little vest and a skirt. How cute. I really, really hope it fits. And I think they would be cute separately as well. And I got too much shit in the kitchen. Um, I got this really soft sweater as well. It's really, really soft. Obviously, you can't feel it, but it's so soft. I like the sleeves of it. Hopefully this fits. I did not try anything on again because we had stuff in the car that needed to be put in the freezer. So yeah, I'm excited. I'll show you guys if it fits later. One hour later. Okay, here is the sweater. It is so freaking soft. I think it was like eight to $12. Not really sure. <laughs> I'll, I'll say it down below, but anyways, it's very soft and super cute. I cannot wait wait to wear it during the fall and the winter months. It's just so cute. <laughs> and it feels like super luxurious, but it's Walmart. So it would look really cute with that skirt that I got too. So let's try on the skirt. I really, really, really hope it fits. Okay, definitely stepping out of my comfort zone, but it does fit. My husband says he likes it. So that's all that matters. That's all that matters. <laughs> um, I think it's really cute. I'm very self-conscious of like the belly area, but I don't know. Could you wear something like control? Probably could wear some Spanx under it and feel a little bit better about my belly, but it is cute. You're welcome. I'm gonna try it with the sweater too because I think that would be really cute together. Okay, here is the sweater with the skirt. It's super cute. I picture it on a brisk fall day, going to the pumpkin patch sipping on a latte, reading a book. It's giving like, I don't know, clueless vibes. I love it. Super cute. Yep, that's all I had. Yeah, I just got a few items from Walmart, so they're cute. I'm excited that they fit me. Good morning, guys. It is Wednesday. I am going to see my mommy. We're gonna go shopping and get some sushi it has been long awaited because I started my job and it's just been hectic so we're gonna go hang out have a little mother daughter day I don't know where we're gonna go yet probably like TJ Maxx because we love TJ Maxx okay I'm gonna take you guys along with us to have a good day
Okay, we just went to Goodwill. Let's go get some sushi and see what else we get up to. What are you gonna do with that? Put like a candle on top of it or you could put like your keys in it many hours later okay i'm back we had dinner my husband made some beef stew so freaking good i figured i'd sit here while i still look cute and do a haul of the stuff that i got at goodwill i got some really cute finds so let's do a little haul the first thing that i got is this really cute um Plant pot. I love the um, the detail on it. It was only $5. I'm going to put my plant in it. Not sure what plant, but we will figure that out later. It's so freaking cute. I just had to take it. I just had to snatch it. It was $5, so put something in here. Even if I just use it as a vase for flowers, it would still be really cute. Such a cute vessel. It reminds me of like something that you would find at Target, like Studio McGee. Picking up this tray, it's really pretty. I think it's like metal and someone painted it. It's got these little feet on it. Um, I think I might end up repainting it because it is a little bit chippy, but I thought it was cute, something like super dainty um, to put like on the coffee table with a candle on it or be like a little catch-all dish for my jewelry or like my little remotes for the TV, what have you. I thought it was cute, so we'll see. Do you guys think I should repaint this or do you like the way it looks now, kind of distressed looking? This is one of my favorite finds. It is so pretty. It's a candelabra that you hang on the wall. I just need to find somewhere to hang it, but I just thought it was so pretty and like chic. It's giving... I don't know, anthropology, mid-century modern. Um, I like um, kind of like vintage, mid-century modern type things. It could also be like leaning a little bit towards French provincial. I just thought it was so pretty. 10 bucks for this and it's, um, it's iron. So it's like really good quality. I just thought it was so pretty. I'm gonna have to figure out where I'm gonna put it, but I'm sure I'll find somewhere to put it. It's just so pretty. You know that I would not leave, that I would not leave without this print. It is so freaking pretty, and I love the gold detail on the frame. It's really pretty. The frame almost has like a crackly effect to it. It just gives like vintage. I love florals, as you guys know, so it's gonna fit in beautifully with my home. It looks like someone did this on their own. I wonder where the print came from. Who knows? But I thought it was really pretty and I love the gold. So, so cute. Six dollars. Oh, and I forgot to tell you guys, this was only like two dollars. So, last but not least, of course, I had to snag the skirt that I tried on. It's so pretty and it's kind of like a silky material. It's going to be perfect for the fall months leading into winter. You could even wear it in springtime because it's got the florals on it. Anytime you want. I mean, girl, wear what you want. <laughs> but I cannot wear to wear this in the fall time, especially with a cute sweater. Maybe that sweater that I got from Walmart the other day. This was only $7.00. Can't wait to wash her and wear her. She is so freaking cute. Okay, that's it for the Goodwill haul. I am tired. I'm going to go downstairs and watch some YouTube and some Game of Thrones. Read my book a little bit. 
and hit the hay. It was a long day. I had a really good day with mom. Um, it's always a fun time going shopping with her, but it is exhausting walking around stores. So your girl's going to go take it easy. I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning. It is the next day. This is what I look like in the morning. <laughs> Obviously, I went shopping at TJ Maxx yesterday, and I picked up some cute stuff for my bedding. My bedding has just not been hitting, so we're going to do a little bedding makeover. I also got this charging station for my husband's phone and Apple iWatch. So, we're going to do a little makeover of the bed area. So, let me show you what I got, and we'll get started. Okay, the first thing I got is this King Duvet cover. Can you see? Maybe. It's kind of like a waffle knit um, duvet cover with some pillowcases. So I thought this would be really nice to bring in some texture for the fall time. I also got another throw blanket. It's a really pretty texture and it's got some fringe on it. I love the color. It will help bring in the tan from the headboard and just kind of make it feel a little bit more neutral in here. Um, I also plan on getting some new pillowcases for my throw pillows, but for now we're gonna do with what I've got. So let's get started. I love the texture of this blanket. I had this color. I love the pattern of it, but I don't like the gray. It just does not fit the vibe of the whole house or the bedroom. So we're gonna switch this out to match the duvet. Hopefully it looks a lot better. It just feels so much more luxurious now. I cannot wait to crawl into bed tonight. <laughs> stole these pillows from down downstairs. I think they'll be really cute for this room for now. I'm still looking for more pillows. It looks so much better already. I can't wait to show you guys what I come up with later, but let me show you. Look at how good it looks already. It's getting fall. I definitely need different pillows, but I love the texture of this duvet cover. So nice. 